Here is the horse stance, <clears throat> also called wide squats, but it's a little bit different than a squat. So for a horse stance, we're gonna measure how far we step out. This is kind of like a traditional thing. I've only seen this with the horse stance, but you're gonna one, two, three, for me, is a good starting point. The feet can be turned out slightly. Um, I think a lot about my arch. Is my arch on and engaged as I go down into the next piece, which is the squat? And I wanna also keep uh, my torso as vertical as possible. So I'm thinking about pulling myself down, almost like a front squat. The knees can travel forward, and then I wanna keep a, uh, a curve in my low back. I'm thinking about rolling my pelvis forward into the position, okay? This, I'm like about parallel. I'm actually probably above parallel, right? I don't even wanna turn 90 and show you, but that's gonna change over the course of the stance and over the course of multiple sets. So I'm already like able to sink a little bit deeper just as I'm talking to you now. And that's just because I'm warming up the position. And while I do it, I'm thinking, okay, can I squeeze my glutes? Can I drive my knees open a little bit? Can I dr uh, grab at the ground with the arches of my feet? Okay, and then can I breathe through some inevitable uh, pain? I even feel a slight stretch of the adductors as I pull the knees apart. You can take a second if you need to, to kind of adjust the torso angle, bring it forward perhaps, um, but then try to come right back, push the hip through, drive the knees apart, and uh, spend the prescribed amount of time in your horse stance. If it's easy for you to get to parallel with three steps, then you're gonna do five steps, one, two, three, four, five, or four steps, or something that's wider, but your focus still has to be pulling straight down into position, driving the knees out, feeling a stretch of the adductors, all the same stuff, especially the outsides of the hips. That's what we're looking to strengthen here, the ability to externally rotate, and just hip integrity. How strong is this guy? How strong is he really? Can he hold on uh, under duration for a long period of time to help you also make that connection to that muscle for the next time you go to squat or deadlift. That is the horse stance.